Hey guys, welcome back. So today we are vlogging, but it's not planned at all. We just headed out to the city after baby C's four month checkup at the pediatrician and he was running super early. So we finished early. So we decided to come out to the city. It's a weekday, so hopefully there are no lines anywhere. But we actually wanted to check out some new pieces at Cartier for the longest time because um, they have launched their brush gold versions of their love bracelets, which can be quite nice for the men, I think. So yeah, we all came out, hubby, baby C and I are in the city now. By the way, excuse my appearance. I, like I said, I came out not ready at all to vlog, so no makeup, hair's just tied back in a bun. So yeah, excuse my appearance, but I guess this is just real life, just being very candid. But yeah, let's head into Cartier and have a look. We are here. There is a short line, but it's pretty good. Uh, I can see some Christmas decorations here. You can see the Clash collection ring and earrings. I tend to think that they look pretty modern and there's a watch there as well. Let's go to the next window. Hubby's just lining up. There are some watches. Beautiful. Christmas tree. Oh, baby sees in it. <laughs> I'll be just pushed the front. Right you see these are the regular love collection. I love that thing. Oh, that one there. Love it. One day. Oh, so here is the brush gold. Brush gold makes it a lot more male friendly, in my humble opinion. Yes. You have to unscrew those. Yes, you forgot about that. What size is this? This one is size 19. 19. That is pretty sweet. Yeah. Because you never wanted the shiny yeah. finish, right? Ooh. And the screws are still shiny. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Which is nice. Nice. Almost looks like little diamonds. Diamonds? <laughs> Baby's <laughs> crying. <laughs> Shiny, so it's probably better to go compare the two. We've got the gold and the. Is there gold. much price difference between uh, the yellow gold? The same price. I mean, both they're the That's same price, price as the regular one well. shiny mm -hmm. one. Um, yellow gold and blue gold. They're both twelve thousand, and the white gold is twelve thousand nine hundred. Okay. Oh, okay. in the pram. You wanted to look around in the store. Are <laughs> you smiling for she's smiling for you guys? <gasps> Love the Christmas tree in the background. Look over here. What are you looking at? You're looking at the beautiful sparkly things. <laughs> We wanted to get these. Mm. Yes. Yeah. I think the thicker one you can see the There's a thicker yeah. one. Mm. Well, my fingers are still not the normal size yet. Mm. But some people say this? like 54. Some people say like the fingers never came back. Right. Yeah. Okay. Um, my fingers were skinny once upon a time. I think they grew like three sizes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay, 
okay. This reminds me of like the grandmas, yeah. you know, the big, yeah, the big moon. This is the chunkiest trinity. Yeah, maybe it's too chunky. Mm. Were there three settings before? No. It has always been three settings. Ah. Mm. Maybe my wrist has settled a bit mm. because this even was too tight before. Mm. Ah, okay. And then we were like, is this for kids? Because it's just so small. Mm -hmm. I think it'll be nice for kids too. Maybe we can hand this down to her. <laughs> it's cute. Alright, we came out of Cartier because Baby C, I think, needed to have a feed. Um, so we ordered some coffees and we're gonna sit here and feed her. These are my bags of the day. So I'm carrying my Chanel mini square flap, which I haven't worn for a long time, but today I am just nice, easy black bag. And then I've got my nappy bag, which is my Lululemon new parent backpack. I've got all baby seeds needs in there, including some formula, hot water, bottle, nappies, wipes, change mat. And he says, what do you need today? We're still very happy with this bag, except if you're considering, and if you need a nappy bag, and if you're considering this bag, the only thing I'd say is that Depending on your pram, it's quite chunky. So we find that this bag sometimes is hard to pull out of um, under, over here, under the bassinet. So yeah, it could be pretty tight depending on your pram. So that's the only thing that I have to say about it. But otherwise, very good nappy bag. So just feeding baby C and my deep have oat cappuccino is here. So we literally walked into Cartier and had like 10, 15 minutes to have a look. What did you think? Thank you. What did you think about the brush fold for love bracelets? Um, I think it was. It looks. It looks fantastic for for guys. Um, but it is quite cumbersome having to unscrew those two screws yeah. and then rescrew yeah. them back on. You like it, but probably not for you. Yeah. Yeah. Did you like the brush fold on me, or was it too masculine? Uh, it did look a little bit masculine. And with all the jewelry that you have that are shiny, I don't think it'll go well together. Yeah. Like the salesperson said. And I guess it probably won't match with my other thin love bracelet, which is in the rose gold um, thin version. Yes. I just haven't worn any jewelry today because we were rushing out the door to get to the appointment on time. But also, I've been finding that my love bracelet has become a little snug since pregnancy and I guess I'm still carrying a lot of baby weight around um, so yeah I think we're gonna wait until I am back to my free baby weight and then try them again but yeah it was really nice to be able to check out those brush gold love bracelets since we really wanted to check them out in person because one of our friends taught us that it looks fantastic with all the screw bits still in the shiny finish so it's kind of a two-tone effect so yeah that that was that was a fun little last minute spur of the moment visit to Cartier while we're in the city I think we're gonna go in and check out Tiffany as well for some bracelets Yeah, you can stack them together. It's very pretty as well. Mm. The rose gold is always a very elegant color. Maybe this is too plain. 
I had to blend. But if you're going to stick it with your bangle, yeah, yeah, if you have some different diamond bangle mm. or something different, so maybe you can try this one. Yeah. This is a small size, but I think you can fit. Might be a bit tight. Looks quite small. Because also designed extra oh, small as well. It's mm. actually not too bad because no. of the shape. Yeah, yeah, the rectangle shape. This is really pretty. Mm. Half how is the my favorite? Is the yeah. best. Yeah. I think full full pave is like very sparkly. Very yeah. yeah. I love half and half. But I like that this you can actually still see the design. Yeah, a bit more. yeah, yeah. Mm. And then some people they even wear like this way. So one in a thick version mm. outside and uh, ah and so will be like other, even right. One yeah. thick and all stacking together, which is very pretty as well. Even the next one you're staking with just a plain bangle with yeah. any other brand mm. or other brand. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I guess with the plain one, you can always stack it with like a tennis bracelet. Or oh, something. yes, yes. Yeah. A bracelet, diamond bracelet, yeah. Any bracelet is so easy. Yeah. Yeah, we do have so many clients, they are staking with the Katia, you know. The, uh, yeah. Yeah. Everyone. <laughs> like, yeah. It's so pretty. Actually. I like that this one, you like, not everyone has them yet. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Rose gold, and you can stack it together. Yeah, yeah, you can stack it together. Yeah, but if you get two tone, I think you can go. Two tone gold doesn't matter. You stack it with the white gold, rose gold, and yeah. yeah. Because the diamond is a white diamond, so basically, mm. as soon as you're stacking with the white, yeah, yeah it's like two tone. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you want me to stack it together for you? Yeah. I guess these ones are easy to Oops. like shorten if you go a bit bigger. Mm. Maybe that's a bit tight, isn't it? But um, the bracelet mm. is not supposed to be. Yeah, Two of course. Ones? If you wanna extend, we can do mm. that for you because this is a small size, small which is size? A seven inch. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want to extend, probably just half inch would be perfect. Mm. Mm. Really nice tech. I think the tennis bracelet is just, yeah, like I yeah. said, it's a dream. It's you know, really it pretty. What you are do together is just perfect. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that this tennis bracelet is mm. a little bit different. So, how many? I mean, like, what's the carrot size? Yeah, so on this one. Mm, don't know, like this total. Okay, so totally together will be around uh, three carat mm. because in the round brilliant cut diamond for this rose gold yeah. will be two point sixty seven mm. carat, and then there is a end which is a flower in the mm. Marquis diamond is a point eighteen. Okay, so almost three carat. Okay, and this, and this one, one is more. Every single round brilliant cut diamond will be bigger mm. and then it will be 6.22 carat okay and then for the marquis diamond in the end it will be 0.31 mm. so they are mm, double all right my visit to tiffany's was cut so short because baby c started crying a lot so hubby and baby c couldn't even come into the store but i really wanted to check out the lock bracelet and the tennis bracelet i've always been interested in um, getting a tennis diamond bracelet but always thought you know it was just really plain and boring but um, that particular tennis bracelet from tiffany's from the is a victoria victory victorian collection with that um with the marquee diamonds at the clasp i thought was you know adding a little bit of a unique touch to otherwise a really boring um, tennis bracelet so i checked those ones out so that was a real quick visit to some of the stores i hope you enjoyed all the eye candies there are lots of beautiful pieces that i'm gonna have a think about but um yeah since these are sort of bigger purchases i think you know it's one of those things that you want to check out and have a think over to see what piece I should add next in terms of my fine jewelry collection so yeah let me know what your favorite piece was thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon in my next video bye guys